You are watching Forbidden Knowledge TV. There have been six US Navy ships named after historic battle at Saratoga. The most recent was the USS Saratoga, commissioned as a US Naval Attack Aircraft Carrier CVA-60 in 1956 and retired from service in 1994. The crew of the USS Saratoga certainly saw their fair share of action, but what they experienced in 1987 not only left them in shock, but also left them confused. One of the strangest stories I've probably ever received directly from uh, what I think is a credible witness uh, came to me many years ago. I was in um, a place with a, an active duty United States Navy officer. Uh, at the time that I met with him, he was uh, an active recruiter, but still doing active duty. And he um, learned that I was a researcher of the subject of UFOs. And after a while, uh, decided to share a very unusual story with me. And uh, in retrospect, I have to say I'm very grateful for the story, and I, if he's out there listening, I want to say thanks for that, sir. Um, this was a really, a really interesting man, and when I was talking with him, I thought this is exactly the kind of guy that anyone would want defending their country. He was a very tall, very smart, very tough guy, and very level-headed man and I really enjoyed my meeting with him, I have to say. And after he got a good sense of uh, the kind of research that I do, he said, all right, I, I'm gonna tell you a very interesting story if you'd like to hear it. And I said, sure, by all means. And he said, back in 1987, I was a young signalman aboard the USS Saratoga. It was a very large aircraft carrier that was ultimately decommissioned in uh, the 1990s after the, after the Persian Gulf War. But in 1987, it was still a very, very active, uh, large carrier. And he was a young guy, and uh, as a signalman, part of his job was to be uh, expert in aircraft identification and light signals and what did this formation of lights mean and what did that formation of lights mean and so forth. I mean, among many other duties that he had. So on uh, this one occasion, as he chuckled, as he said to me, at where we were in the Bermuda Triangle, <laughs> off the uh, US Eastern Coast. And this was uh, May of 1987. So they're out in the middle of nowhere and they're with a, a fleet. The fleet, incidentally, uh, he pointed out to me, was under the command of uh, a very well-known admiral named Jeremy Borda. Borda, incidentally, was a very highly regarded Navy admiral and who tragically took his own life some years later as a result of a scandal. You have a fleet of Navy ships in this region, according to this Navy officer, and he is a young guy. He's aboard the Saratoga on the deck. It's about midnight or so, and he's looking out uh, at the ocean, and it's nothing but pitch black whatever direction he looked. And he said, and off in the distance on the horizon, I saw this light and it just rose from the horizon up to a higher point and then it stopped. And he thought, I have no idea what that would be. So he continued to watch this light and then he noticed that it was, or it seemed to be coming toward the ship, toward the Saratoga, at a zigzag. So this way, this way, this way, and so forth. Now at that point, you can imagine he was absolutely uh, confused and, and mystified as to what this could be. So he's on radio communication with other people on the ship and they're talking about this object approaching the ship and the conversation something like, do you see that 
Yes, we see that. What could that be? We have no idea what that could be. So they decide to scramble an aircraft to engage or at least to investigate or intercept this thing. And they scramble an A-7 Corsair aircraft, which takes off and gets to a certain distance of wherever this object is and has some kind of malfunction whereby the pilot is forced to eject and they actually lose the aircraft. Uh, the pilot was recovered, the pilot survived. So the decision is then made to scramble a second aircraft. This is an F-14 Tomcat, which certainly at the time in 1987 was the Navy's top level fighter interceptor. A fantastic aircraft. So the Tomcat's on its way to this object. And according to uh, the Navy officer who's telling me the story, the Tomcat gets to within a certain distance, not sure how close, when this object, this thing, whatever it is, instantly takes off and is gone. And the F-14 has absolutely no chance of engaging with this whatsoever. So the F-14 returns. And that would be the end of the story, except, well, that it wasn't the end of the story. Hi, I'm Billy Carson, researcher, speaker, and best-selling author of The Compendium of the Emerald Tablets and Woke Doesn't Mean Broke. I'm inviting you to join me on ForbiddenKnowledge.tv to enjoy hours of great programming, learn the secrets of ancient Egypt, unexplained structures on the moon and Mars, financial literacy, holistic and healthy lifestyles. Go now to ForbiddenKnowledge.tv and get three days free. While there, you can enter to win a Rolls Royce. That's ForbiddenKnowledge.tv. You are watching Forbidden Knowledge TV. Hi, my name is Billy Carson, and I'm the president of Forbidden Knowledge. We have an amazing investment opportunity here for anyone who wants to buy shares in Forbidden Knowledge. The money that's generated from this crowdfunding platform is going to be used to bring on a new content acquisitions partner. We're going to hire a new in-house graphics designer, a social media manager, a put together a customer service team and a customer service management program that will organize and satisfy all the different legs of Forbidden Knowledge Inc. As well as, and of course, make more improved high quality streaming content for the Forbidden Knowledge TV platform, which right now is featured on Apple TV, Roku, Amazon Fire TV, iOS and Android apps, and also of course, the web. The streaming platform is a year old right now and doing very, very well. And we're looking for your support where you can not only be a conscious customer, but also be a part owner in an amazing opportunity that includes streaming TV, book publishing, and e-commerce. Grow with us and earn with us. Forbidden Knowledge Inc. You are watching Forbidden Knowledge TV.